Because he made everything himself. There were, there were, I mean, he. I think the only thing he was really buying was soldering iron. You know, I mean, he. he every everything else he made, he made the epoxy out of the hooves of animals that he was trapping, and uh, so, so there was there was no f uh, fingerprint for him. There's no footprint. They couldn't find him. Mm. And he was a. I mean, I guess. This is going to sound bad, but he was a brilliant man, brilliant mathematician at the very, at the at the very least, deranged maybe, but uh, incredibly intelligent. Yeah, and I, I mean, I don't think that the 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 uh, I don't think one can feel sympathy for him, and I don't think that the the show looks to elicit sympathy, but you can absolutely feel empathy for the child who you know was brilliant, 168 IQ. Um, is is moved two grades ahead at puberty, ends up in Harvard by the age of 16, and is then experimented on by the CIA for three years. And yeah, and and by the way, his code name when he was in that project was Lawful. Right, that was that was that was his his code name for him, and and it was a humiliating experience that went on for three years in this 16 year old boy and. There were experiments that were specifically about sort of belittling, belittlement and, and, and punishment, right? The, 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 yeah, exactly. Sorry, I haven't explained myself well. The experiments were all about... The, the objective was, was mind control uh, and, and was about breaking uh, Soviet spies. And so they were experimenting this new technique of humiliation on, on these children, of which he was absolutely the youngest, having arrived at Harvard at 16. And I guess looking for friends... You know. Uh, anyway, so then he goes to. He ends up at Michigan, um, uh, starts writing proofs that five people in the world can understand, and then um, becomes the youngest tenured professor in Berkeley history at 23 years old, and then disappears into the woods and starts killing people. And um, th that that bit of it is monstrous um, and is impossible to feel sympathy for. Um, but the bit of it that you, I think, can feel empathy for is that is that incredibly damaged um, uh, child. 